There's no messing around as they strip it to the ground and prep this iron horse for paint. And with Pat's disassembly out of the way and the sheet metal off to be painted, we had ease to pay a visit to the one and only Dino Petrocelli. Here today, I have a lot of work. I have a lot of stuff that's being printed, a lot of magazines that are out right now, and I wanted, to, I wanted to have an exhibit to show my work, not just my bike work, but all my photography throughout the years. And I'm not one to like do things really small. I like to make it fun and happy. So what I did was, I'm showing all my work, and I said, you know, instead of coming and just looking at pictures and leaving, let's bring some bikes in that I've shot, let's bring some custom builders in that I've shot, let's bring a couple bands in and hang out for the day. You know, not just to come in, look around and leave, but hang out for the day and have a good time. How many more can I have? I don't know! <laughs> I started uh, photography probably 35 years ago now. Got a little uh, point-and-shoot camera for a, for a Christmas gift, a little plastic box camera. And when I thought I could make an image, you know, like that, it stuck with me. It's just one thing that stuck with me all my life. And it just the the more I progress, the more I want to do it. Fantastic. Now I see you've done quite a bit of work here, and uh, have worked with. Uh, 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 the man himself from Orange County. Yeah, the yeah. Guys. How, how did you get all that? All, uh, that all came about through some of the magazines I was shooting for. Um, Orange County took an ad out on the back, the back of the magazine, and they needed a photographer to shoot their, uh, shoot their uh, ad for the magazine. And then that all, from there, it just snowballed. The work, the word started getting around. My name started getting out there. People started seeing my work, and and uh, it just snowballed. Well, tell us uh, exactly what's going on here today, and uh, well. Here today, I have a lot of work. I have a lot of stuff that's being printed, a lot of magazines that are out right now, and I wanted to, I wanted to have an exhibit to show my work, not just my bike work, but all my photography throughout the years. And I'm not one to like do things really small. I like to make it fun and happy. So what I did was, I'm showing all my work, and I said, you know, instead of coming and just looking at pictures and leaving, Let's bring some bikes in that I've shot. Let's bring some custom builders in that I've shot. Let's bring a couple bands in and hang out for the day. You know, not just to come in, look around and leave, but hang out for the day and have a good time. So uh, what's the next step for Dino? Uh, for me, just keep plugging away. You know, I started, you know, I, I, you're seeing all the bikes right now. I got a couple of car shots uh, that, I've, that I've been doing. So now my, my next level of shooting because of my expansion of the studio, I'm getting into shooting cars. I'm getting into, you know, bigger, bigger, uh, bigger projects now. So I'm hope, hopefully, uh, you know, it's going to continue to grow. Uh, uh, we do the framing and mounting and laminating for Dino. So okay. any of the processing for his pictures, we do. And it's a special process where we take the picture and it's got a special coating on it that he selects. And um, it enhances the picture a little bit more. So. Okay, and you have uh, different, uh, like there's Satin there's satin, there's high gloss, which he likes a lot of, um, and then we can also combine the process with different moldings. So we can do a lot of high-end bike shots and make them look spectacular. Sometimes you need a molding around it, sometimes not, because we want the emphasis to be on the bike, not on what we do. What we do is incidental. So, it, looks, it looks fantastic. Yeah, though. we want everybody to look at the bike. And um, I'll tell you what. Anything paper. Why, why don't you point out? Well, yeah. This this one here is uh, done with a satin finish, framed all the way to the edge. This one here is a high gloss, all the way to the edge. But this one, we wanted to combine the two, so we got this special molding in that we had done, so it looks like tire tracks to enhance the bike. But this is a process we've been doing for over 10 years now, and. I was lucky enough to see Dino on television one day and it took me a while to work up my courage to go over and knock on his door because he's a celebrity. And I went over and told him this 
Mr. Petroselli and Tommy Dino. Okay. <laughs> and, <laughs> and I see there's so a we, we, family we, connection now. Yeah, so we decided to put together this show so that not just bike people would come, but that everybody would come because it's art. What these guys are building and the photographs is art. And so we wanted a lot of people to be able to come and put some bands out there and just have a good time. Great. So. Great.